Well guys, I'm a hundred miles from anywhere, in the middle of the desert. There's a great big bang. Let's go out and see what it is. It's box truck curry. Wow, it sure does seem funny leaving Scorched Freedom, leaving camp for the very last time. TP Tammy's tin can house met with a terrible fate. The wind, the wind took it down. We had a really bad windstorm, and that was all she wrote. We'll see what's left when we get back next year. Do you think the fire pit will still be there? The spindles. It's all part of the Slab City experiment, guys. There's my spot. What do you girls think? What do you think, Dopey? You ready to move on? I'm getting hot, Dad. It's certainly warming up. It's, uh, it's really it's too hot for me. I'm not comfortable through the middle of the days. It's, uh, it's time to move on. Now this sign speaks the truth, guys. Reality is ahead. For me, anyway. The long drive back to Canada. California to New York and then north. Man, it was worth it. What an awesome time here in Slab City. Man, am I glad I came. And you should too. Don't fear this place, guys. It is just an awesome example of a anarchist squat community. I'm 100 miles from anywhere in the middle of the desert. There's a great big bang. Let's go out and see what it is. Can you guys fix the truck? Can you? What happened, guys? What broke? Sounded like a bomb went off. Came from the back. Oh. I see it over there. Look at this, guys. Absolute middle of nowhere. The desert. Can't see anything. Wow. Since there's nothing impeding the other tire, maybe I'll just drive it. Well, only two hours into the drive home and already problems. See, the thing of it is, <laughs> now that uh, I've got these uh, heart and lung problems, I don't have enough strength to get those lug nuts off. So, I tried just to see if they would come off easily and I can't budge any of them. There's just no way I can do that. So I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna try and drive to the next town, which is about 100 miles away. I don't know how that's gonna go, but I don't want to sit here and wait for a tow truck. I'll be here all day. Hmm, hmm, hmm. There's no weight in the back. Maybe just that one other tire there can carry it. Like, there's two on the other side. <laughs> the last thing I want to do is fuck up the existing good tire, though, because I don't got money to buy two. So, I'll keep you up to date on how it goes. I'm in the desert outside of Slab City, uh, north north of 10. Well, um, I'm gonna try and limp into Parker, Arizona. I think that's my best bet. That's the closest city, and I'm 100 miles away. And uh, I don't know. I hope I don't break anything else on the way. I'll let you know how it goes. I'll keep you up to date. Maybe the biggest problem with California, right here. Check this out. Can you believe that? 480 a gallon.
for diesel. That's insane. Getting it fixed. Got my spare tire they're gonna put on for 15 bucks. And the, uh, the other first place I went to wanted 40. But apparently the spare tire isn't in the greatest condition either. It's old with some cracks. But it'll do for now, hopefully. Tire experts here in Parker, Arizona, hooking me up. Bunch of good guys. It's a nice little spot here in Parker. Camped for the night and hopefully no more flat tires because I used my spare and I don't have money to buy another, but we will see. 36 hours of driving ahead.